Hi everyone, Erin here from Real Wig Fun. Today we're gonna to take a look at a new Ellen Villa style and this is called Aleda. And I have Aleda in the color Beige Multi Shaded, so stay tuned. Now, I know many of you have been asking, Erin, I wanna see some more short styles. So if that is you, you're gonna to wanna to check this out. So as always, I need to thank my friends at Wigs by Patty's Pearls for supplying this wig so I could bring a review for you today. And not only do I think that this style is gorgeous, but I think this has got to be one of my favorite Ellen Villa colors, beige multi-shaded. This color is outstanding. So stay tuned and we'll take a deeper look. So Elena is actually part of Ellen Villa's Modiques collection. It is a cheeky short cut with slanted asymmetrical bangs and it is incredibly lightweight. So if you love shorter styles, this is definitely one that you're going to want to check out. So why don't I do a turn so that you can see this beautiful style from all sides. So clearly this is my front, but why don't I get up close so that you can see the hairline. I think the hairline has been done incredibly well. The knotting looks good. The lace looks good. It does have an extended lace into the ear tabs. And what I love about this style that I'll show you later is how many ways you can style this, okay? So that is the front. This is my right side. And the back. I think the back is absolutely beautiful. My left side. And then back to the front. So Aleda is made from Ellen Villa's heat-friendly synthetic fibers and they feel incredible. They're really, really good. It's got a left-handed monofilament part. Let me get up close so that you can see that illusion of hairline. I think it's done really well and the density is really realistic so that you can absolutely see that illusion of scalp, which I'm loving. So some of you may have heard that traditionally Ellen Villa is known to have a smaller cap size. So in comparison to, for example, Beltress or Raquel Welch, an average to an average would be a little bit smaller on Ellen Villa. And for the most part, although I have a 22 inch circumference head, my Ellen Villa pieces actually fit me quite well. And 22 inches would be on the high side of average. With all of that said, I am finding that Aleda is a little bit smaller in the cap than I am finding in my more recent Ellen Villa pieces. So the cap on Aleda is described as a petite average, but even as a 22 inch circumference head, I could absolutely wear this. Um, it is a little bit snug, but it's absolutely wearable. So I love shorter pieces, hairstyles that have these longer sections it just gives the ability and flexibility to be able to style it in so many different ways. You know, you could absolutely wear this off your face and completely change up the look of this wig, whether you choose to tuck behind your ears and the density is low enough that you could absolutely do that. You know, you can tuck this back and make this much more sleek if you wanted to. And how great is that to have that type of flexibility? Or if you would like, you know, a more voluminous look, you can get that. You could wear it, like I said, off your face because that hairline is done so incredibly well. Or you could wear it down and across, you know, in a very beautiful feminine way. So those lengths that I talked about earlier, these front sections here are five and a half inches. The crown is also five and a half inches. The sides are five and a quarter, and that beautiful nape comes in at 2.5 inches. And then altogether, this wig weighs only 2.4 ounces, which really means it's gonna be very wearable all day long. So let's just talk about this gorgeous color, beige multi-shaded. And as I mentioned earlier, it's probably one of my favorite Ellen Villa shades. So I also filmed some footage for you and I'll drop it here next of what this color looks like in natural sunlight. So the description on this color is it's a light brown with light strawberry blonde mixed with a light natural blonde and then it has shaded roots. 
What I really love about this rooting is I think it's done really well. It blends out into the body of the shade really beautifully. And I think the highlights and the dimension of this color, especially on this style where you've got so much different layer and texturing in this style, it really, I think it really shows off this color and style beautifully. All right, I'm going to go ahead and take the wig off so that we can look at the inside of this cap. Just there is a closer look at that gorgeous shade, beige, multi-shaded. Gorgeous, isn't it? And then we'll turn the cap inside out. And there is that left-handed monofilament part. The lace that runs all the way into the ear tabs makes that natural, a very natural transition. So when you go to style the wig off your face, you can do that with confidence, especially with wigs that have cap con uh, construction features like an extended lace. Um, open wefted sides and back. It does have an extended nape and I like this as a general cap construction, but particularly on short styles with short napes like this one has, having that wider extended nape really helps to keep the wig down at the base of your neck. And so for people like myself that has a very low natural hairline, I love this cap feature, especially on a shorter hairstyle. And you know what, I've gotta say it, and perhaps you've been thinking it too, for those of you that are John Renault Ignite fans, I really think you're going to want to take a look at Ellen Villa's Aleda because I see a lot of similarities. I may say actually though, between the two, I think I actually prefer this one. So anyways, I hope that you have enjoyed this quick look at Ellen Villa's brand new Aleda from their Modiques collection. Stay well and stay safe. Bye everybody.